box. We got a big package. My mom's coming tomorrow. I'm very excited. I've built so many pieces of furniture. I do not need to read instructions anymore. It's cozy with the pillows. Obviously, there's a lot to do with mom coming tomorrow. I'm gonna give Drew a tour. I'm kind of striking out, you guys. I found mom at the airport. She's here. <laughs> oh, it looks so good with your color that you're wearing. Indigo sunset. Good morning. Uh, what is today? Mm, Thursday, maybe? It may be Thursday. Yes, it is Thursday because my mom's coming tomorrow. I'm very excited. Um, so I've got a lot to do today. I've kind of gathered everything for the guest bedroom so that I can start working on it. And now she's coming tomorrow. <laughs> and I kind of lost track of time, I feel like. I don't know, I've just, I've been been trying to rest, honestly. So I've been a little bit procrastinating diving into a project, um, but I am I am really excited. So I have today and tour. She's not coming until later tomorrow. Uh, so we have time. And even if I'm still decorating when she's here, that's okay, it's mom, you know? Uh, Kinsley's over there looking very cute. Look at her, she's like working at the desk. Are you working? By the way, you guys know, in, I think two vlogs ago, I was telling you that I was watching you on Netflix and I finished it that night. I was not, I, I didn't guess. As I think if you finished it, maybe a lot of people didn't know what was going to happen. Now knowing what I know, no spoilers. I would never spoil it for you guys. Knowing what I know now, I'm re-watching it and I'm seeing it in a completely different way. It's fun. It's like I'm, I'm seeing things differently. Oh. <laughs> It's crazy. Uh, so if you haven't watched it, I thought, I thought personally, I thought it was really good. So this room has kind of gotten another uh, mess, if you will. And I think Drew uh, might come over today to see the house. Uh, he was texting me earlier, but he was working on his video. So he might come, but I got a big, a big old package. Hold on. So I wanna open this big box. We got a big package. It's actually a chair uh, because obviously, you know, we don't have tons of furniture. <laughs> we moved from an apartment that was on the smaller-ish side to this house, and this room is completely empty. There's space, there's space. So I have this chair, um, Castro already actually sent it to me because I'm gonna be working on a really fun project with a bed for our bedroom with them. So I'm super, super excited. So they gifted it, it was a gift for me. Um, I wanna see what it looks like. This. Remember, this is the shade that came on that lamp that I got from the flea market. I didn't even want it. It's silk, but it's destroyed. Like it's cracked, it's dirty. Maybe I can donate it, but why? It's ruined, it's just trash. Got some stuff I need to take upstairs, a makeover. Little, little compost bin that our neighborhood watch gave us. All my art that I have left really is kind of all around like it's strung around so i want to make a spot for it we'll be kind of picking from these as we do the bedroom and the bathroom we do that too packages i got two things from amazon because my mom's mattress is sitting on the floor and i kind of not sit on the floor even though like we'll obviously you do like a a complete makeover redesign of that room eventually um that takes thought process time research this is making a guest bedroom look nice with decor i have and little things that i can order that's on a budget just to make it comfortable you know like we need it to be functional until we finish this cottage we need it to be good. Um, so I ordered a bed frame, a metal one, a hundred bucks from Amazon, which will hold us over for the next however many, I don't know how long, months, a year. Um, and then I ordered a slip cover, a bed skirt for it, slip cover. A bed skirt for it from Amazon. This was like $15. So essentially I can completely cover. <gasps> oh, okay. Um, 
the box sunk on what I'm sitting on. I feel like this is going to be like a great, like budget friendly thing that you can do. If you don't want to invest in a, a like a super expensive bed frame, you can really do this for a hundred ish dollars and have a nice little thing happening. So I got this. I just got it in off white because I think it's gonna go well with the bedding that I have for up there. Oh, Seishu Beauty. This is Sarah's line. Fine. Oh, I can't wait to try. I got number one, two, and three. Pinked, Mwavi, and New Hide. I don't know how to say the names. Oh. Peel off lip liner tattoo. Okay, well this is like a bigger thing that we need to try. Okay, now we are to the chair. I think that this is the feet. This is the Adams chair from Castlery. This chair you can get in a couple different colored fabrics. You can also customize the feet um, so that you can have brass or black or silver. And I got black. Love. Oh, I love the color. It has like a lot of visual texture. I love seeing fabrics in person because it's so hard to tell like online, but this is really pretty. If you can see, you see that texture? It's got like, it's almost like salt and pepper, if that makes sense. You know, like an off-white and a, a charcoal. So not an extreme black and white, but like, you know, a little bit off of each color. There's like two little arm pillows and then the back one. How am I gonna get this out? place in the guest bedroom for like a little seating area, but we have all those built-ins. So it doesn't really work unless I blocked the built-in. You know, like I could do it in the corner, but then you wouldn't be able to access the drawers. And I just don't like design like that. That just like block stuff, which that's not practical. You won't live like that, you know? And then it's just in the way. Okay, feet. Yeah, really nice. Just like clean. I've built so many pieces of furniture. I do not need to read instructions anymore. I know what needs washers. I know what order the washers go. <laughs> it's like, it's kind of crazy. So I couldn't find the bit that would fit this. So we're doing it by hand. I think there's a... If you feel lonely, I will Do you guys believe it that my arms are still weak? Like, I just don't feel as strong, you know, like they're just sore. But it will never last down. Here by the ocean, fire is burning, flat as in the wind. Over the mountains, I see the moon, so. a wider seat you know like this is like a lot wider and love big furniture oversized furniture okay where are we gonna put it i mean there's obviously this room has no furniture but then it's just you know only a chair in here for now there's also this space here so obviously i put well i have that pushed back because i was like filming the podcast but um you know it, I just separated it because that's all we had. So I could bring it in here and put it here. It's just going to be like a, you know, a wall. You're going to run into a piece of furniture. We've been so used to having this open, but I feel like it would be pretty to see what it would look like. Let me, let me bring it in. So I actually really like the chair. What I don't like is what's happening here. <laughs> you know, like you need, if you have a chair like this and you're kind of creating symmetry on each side of a fireplace, more than often you need either the same chair on each side or a very complementing chair in terms of like size. This is so much obviously squattier and shorter because this is part of the couch. So 
it I, it doesn't work here, but I really like the tone. You see how it's like um, a little more richer, a little more deeper in color, even though it's still neutral. This is a lot lighter. And so I really like the tone in here. I love it with the rug. I love it with, you know, obviously we're gonna add some mood in here in other ways, because it's just a, a white canvas right now. I also love the scale. But ideally, I would have wanted in here, specifically since there's a TV, I would have wanted swivels. Two swivel chairs that you can turn and watch the TV, but then turn and have a conversation. So this probably will look really good in the other room, but we don't have anything in there. So we'll um, keep it here for now. Okay, I'm heading upstairs to see what I need to do. I need to start filming. This is going to be, it's really overcast today, so I'm not getting a lot of sunlight um in here at all obviously there's a lot to do with mom coming tomorrow there's a lot to do <laughs> there's a lot to do okay um i also made a mess in here because i was actually unpacking all of my candles so it's like it's kind of like that type of stuff so i'm gonna film a little bit of the before the way it's currently looking because this is real life and then I'll start my video and then we will together on the vlog, we'll tackle what's in those things. Okay, I've actually made some progress, not gonna lie. But I think someone's here. I think someone's. I'm coming! It's so beautiful outside. Oh my God, can you see her? Hi, kids. Oh my gosh, she's jumping. Oh yeah, she, she loves to jump. She has a lot of energy. Oh. Say hi to everyone. <gasps> oh my god, that's so pretty. That art. My mom made that one. She would. Yeah, she would. She would. She would. It's crazy to think that in like like a hundred years, like someone could like find one of your mom's paintings and it's just like one of the paintings we find, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like it's just, And it's just her. And it's just her painting that she painted. And now they have it in their house. Yeah. Put your stuff anywhere. Oh There's this room has gosh. nothing. I'm gonna give Drew a I'm tour. Lunch. <laughs> Look at our food. We got grilled cheese and meatballs. And you look at this. Got grilled cheese too. This is this is yeah jalapeno, but it's a fried chicken sandwich. That's a grilled cheese chicken sandwich. <laughs> I got the best of both worlds. I know. So. Just got home. We had a great kind of like early dinner, I guess you could say, because it's only like six o'clock now, and we started eating like four. 30 or so. I like to see him every time I'm here and now that I'm here more often in LA we get to hang out more and just like we just speak the same language. Do you know what I mean? Like we it's we like we speak the same language. It's like him in real life. We get we speak the same language like my mom and I speak the same language. So it's just nice to talk like, especially like with like just everything in life. You know, from work to design to life. It's it's so good getting to see him. Um, I'm going to see him again next week, uh, which is going to be really exciting because we're going to film the podcast actually and talk about our buying and renovating our first home. So um, that's going to be like super fun. Okay, I know I was in the process of building the bed uh, when he got here. Oh yeah, he left all the lights on. Ugh. I mean, I did, I have made lots of progress, but we were in like the bed situation and now it's dark out. So I'm wondering, well, it's not dark, but it's getting there. I'm wondering if I should resume this in the morning. I moved these boxes into his room. So these are all my DIY supplies. So I'm thinking this closet is like his stuff, but maybe his actual clothes or his business stuff. I'm not sure, but see this, this side over here is all empty. So there's like shelves here, shelves there. I guess I could put shelves. We could buy shelves. And I could put more shelves in that one instead of hanging. That's actually really smart. Maybe I should do that. And then mom's coming into town tomorrow. So I've got to finish this. I have like all morning and like until like the afternoon or so. And then I have to head to the airport and pick her up. Listening to the birds chirp out the window. It's everything. I love it here so much. Good morning, guys. I am going to be working on the bedroom all day and I don't have a rug. I need one. I was thinking like, oh, maybe I don't need one. I know I don't want to invest in a vintage rug for upstairs. And I mean, I just, they're expensive. And I have one down here and I have a few like 
and I think that it's really valuable on the like the bottom level where they get seen a lot and I can appreciate them a lot, but in a guest bedroom, I don't really see the point. I, I have two spots in mind that we could go. One is World Market. Um, I was in there uh, maybe a few months ago and I saw one that was actually really pretty. So I wanna take the pillow color, like the, this is the, the bedding that's going in there. So I wanna take this, even though, I mean, it's very neutral, but you know, undertones matter. So I'm gonna take this and I know that that painting has lots of green in it, but obviously, can't bring that painting inside world market uh world market and home goods because home goods i was in there i've been going in there frequently uh over the last like month or so and there was like a lot like they had a lot of rugs and i need my hair to dry before i start filming and stuff so okay we have arrived got my stuff here Please. i think they have something that's that's nice not boho and I used to get a lot of boho stuff here, but not really, that's not my vibe anymore, you know what I mean? The fear was confirmed. They're not quite right. They're a little too Moroccan, boho. Um, it's not the look I want for that room. So now I'm looking at the bath mats. This one's quite nice. I like that it's charcoal, but it has some texture. They also have a green one. I always forget how much I love World Market's like little things. Do you know what I mean? I got this smooth like butter milk chocolate cookie butter to go on my mom's pillow i know that that's like a bigger chocolate situation than you would normally find on your pillow but i feel like my mom deserves a full bar i mean it's a mini bar and this is so cute look how beautiful this is honeysuckle and white flowers bath and shower oil so you drop add one to two tablespoons to running water um so it's essentially like bubbles but oil that is beautiful they had a couple of different ones too um but my mom does not like anything lavender so i always you know a lot of stuff that stuff has lavender in it so i always make sure not to get any of that we are going to map to home goods kind of striking out you guys i don't see anything like there was one back here like really cool tones and I like warm tones but I do need some lampshades for the lamps I got at the flea market so I'm hoping that these work because they're like that dark oatmeal color that I like that's really all I see here or I have to go to like a lamp store you guys I thought I was just looking for a rug didn't find one I needed all of this stuff I needed pillows I have no more pillows we had no extra bed needed pillows lampshade I got like a candle you know always have to get a candle but like a hundred dollars later here we are needing lots of stuff i didn't know i needed oh my gosh how do i get out of here good morning guys stay stay kinsley mom will be back with honey i am going to pick up my mom from the airport i'm very excited hold on actually coming in a day later we changed her flight we are on our way now i'm very excited she's had rough flights so i don't know if she's gonna want to say hi right away but know that i'm going to get her and she is arriving found mom at the airport she's here <laughs> we're back at home goods look at this one it's unexpected I'm very into it this is an option or that's the a good size. Oh, there's some more on this side we didn't even look at yet, Mom. Or this one, also really pretty. Smaller, so it would have to kind of go with the end. I don't like that one. You said you like that? No, I don't. Oh, no. It would have to go at like the end, but it's like so cheap. It's 129. 
pussy. Wait, wait, wait. Can you say honey? Huh? Honey. Can you say McKenna? <laughs> hey, I'll take it. All day long, I'll take it. Okay, I think that this is awesome. I've never quite like <laughs> mom likes it. Oh, it looks so good with your color that you're wearing. See that warmth? I love that. Yes. Look, the model. She's modeling the rug for us. We make the room feel really interesting. And I think I could use it in other spaces if it doesn't work. So what's our rule? What's our rule? If you buy it for mom, it stays in mom's room. That's not our rule. <laughs> <laughs> what is our rule? If what number see, rule? If you, oh, oh, we have if lots you of rules. If you can see it from, in more than one place, get it. Because you'll regret it double or three times if you don't. We add a little sentence to the rule, and I like it. I like it. It, it helps buy it. Okay, we need this. I think it's cool, and it's warm. That warmth that I wanted. Walk on it, everything. It's softer and softer and softer. Cause it's wool, wool and cotton. We made it back to the house. We walked around. We dissected all of the flowers on the property to figure out what they are. It's like an English garden here at the house. It's like every plant next to each other. It's all different. Different kinds of roses, camel roses, camellias, azaleas. Some kind of spitosporum. Spit spitosporum. I we need mean. to look them up. Yeah. So we did that for a little bit. Then I ran errands. I went to Target. I got us a wagon, but I don't know. It was in a box, so I don't know. If I don't want to get to the flea market in the morning and then. All of a sudden, I have to put this together in the parking lot. So I brought it in so I can see if it needs to be put together. But, you know, I was very happy for my mom to come, but I was also very happy for her to bring me my Kindle. Yeah. I have been lost without this. I Why do it. I love this thing so much? I did it. Special delivery. Just Special it. delivery. It got delivered to Texas, to that house, and because they, they um, replaced it. If you missed that, my Kindle died, and then they replaced my Kindle, but they had already shipped it there um, by the time it took so long. But I'm very excited. Kinsley, I know you're excited. I already finished one of my books. When I got here, I got two. I finished it two days ago, but I didn't want to start the next one because I had already started a book on my Kindle before it died. So I waited until mom got here so I could finish that one. So I get to set this up because we didn't see this house in spring. Right, so when we saw the house for the first time, it was a late October or maybe mid October. We're gonna see a lot of like what the grounds and the like the landscaping looks like this spring, um, and it's already starting. The azaleas and the camellias are already blooming, uh, and the roses are starting to like leaf out because we cut all of those back. Um, well, the garden we we. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, why are you <laughs> laughing at me? Because uh, you don't mean me and you. No, we. we when I say we, <laughs> I don't mean mom and I cut the roses back. I mean we as in my sweet little gardener family that comes. You know, they, they did that for me. We are going to the flea market and this is going to be necessary. They had another one in the beach section but it had like big tires, like sand tires, but we didn't need that. And it was like a minty color. We are ready for the flea. I have to edit this video so that you guys actually have something to watch. Now I have the hiccups. You're already on episode four of this? Uh -huh. Wait, it's called Not Dead Yet? That's uh -huh. the you You've been gone a long time. You watched four I watched episodes? Three. Since I've been gone? Since I went to Target? Yes. It's only 30 minutes. Oh. Oh, really 20 minutes. Look, 20 yeah. minutes. We hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. We are going to have a very fun yeah. couple of days. Yeah. Tomorrow. <laughs> that cups. Tomorrow and then also on Monday. I have some things planned. We will see you guys very, very soon. But tomorrow you're going to, to the flea market. I haven't had hiccups in forever. <laughs> Do I hold my breath? <laughs> I think I got rid of my hiccups. I hold my breath.